wasn't. Because <laughs> here I am. I found you, but I didn't. <sighs> this is, oof. This is not what I had in my head at all. Okay. So, just, just to get this straight, we just got a way out. They think we're dead and you want to stay. Stay with an army that kept you against your will for years. I have to make sure you're protected. Oh, that's not it. I have to keep them from coming for our home. They're coming for it, you know that? They could, one day. One day? I've been looking the other way, and you said it. They, they kill innocent people. Isn't that what you wanted? I'm in. I stay and make sure Judith and our son are protected from that. Oh, this is bullshit. <laughs> Listen to me. The first man you and Nat killed, his name was Okafor. And he's who saved my life. He wanted me to become a part of the CRM, move up, help him change it. I didn't have anything left, so I gave myself to his mission. His mission? Do you remember the life we built? What we had? What we were building? It's kept people alive. I saw you. Standing there behind her. A soldier at attention for this army. And I thought, he's a prisoner here. And we have to break out. You don't choose to stay in prison when the doors open. You leave. We've been crawling around in the dirt so long, Michonne, losing people we love. This felt like a way or a chance to, to stop that, not to surrender to it, to fight for everyone. That place is not your responsibility. You have a family. Okafor's gone. Thorn's one of them. Now I'm the only one left. So, you're trying to, uh, keep us safe by maybe changing the CRM one day. Who might come after our home and put it in danger? 